to my channel. I'm so excited to be back. Today I'm coming to you guys with a very exciting video. A lot of you have asked where I um, work and what my salon looks like. So I wanted to come in and do a full salon tour now that I have my studio pretty much together. Let's go, you guys. So I'm studio number two. Okay, so this is my space. I'll give you guys a little bit of an overview and just a few specs about my space. So here at Sola, there are, I think, three different layouts that you can choose. You can have either the small single, single studio, the large single studio, or you can do a double. So when I first moved here, I had the small single studio, and now I've moved to the large. So with the large comes a window and a little bit more space. So for my studio, I really wanted to go for more of a girly chic trendy um space and i knew what i had in mind but it just took me a lot of time to figure out where i wanted to get the things and which specific items i wanted to put in here so we'll just start from here um here is my hair dryer and i got this chair here that i love so much from wayfair i love the chair and I, initially i had two chairs i had two right here so here I got this bar cart from Home Goods, and I absolutely love it. It really gives me that homey feel, really trendy and cute, really chic, and I feel like I could do a lot with this piece. So I just went ahead and I put some coasters here. I don't remember where I got these coasters, but I'm thinking Target a while ago. And then I found this um, really cute um, candle from Home Goods. They have the cutest candles for like $8, so I love. And then I got this cute little... Um, what is this, like a vase from Target for like $5 and I just put a few pompous grasses in there. So here is probably my favorite part of the room and it's recently finished. Um, I got this mirror from home goods again i've been looking for the perfect layer to go in this space and i love it um i love how wide it is you can get your whole body in it um my clients can check their hair when they're done they absolutely love this space um and of course check it out here's my newest addition to the room this is my neon sign and i absolutely love it When it's nighttime, it literally will light up the whole hallway. The whole it just it's a whole vibe. So I love it. So here is my hair rack where I usually keep all of my hair. We're partially out of stock right now, so I don't have much in anymore. But as you guys probably know already, I do sell textured extensions. So here are my kinky curly extensions, and here are the loose curly. So I got this really cute rack from Amazon. And it was kind of hard to put up, I'm not gonna lie, but I absolutely love the look it gave. So here's where I keep my ring light, as you know, we can't do nothing in here without a ring light. So I use this baby every day. I love it. It's my, it's my baby. And here is a really cute piece that I got from Target a few years ago. I think I got this at my first studio um, and I just always used it. I loved it and it went with like the pink and gold vibe that I had going on. So I got this from Target. Okay, so here is my wash bowl. Y'all, this is the best wash bowl I've ever sat in in my life. What I love about it is my clients can rest their head into the wash bowl because they have this um, padded headrest. So it's really comfortable for them. It's really easy for me to wash them and it makes it a really seamless process. So here you guys, I love these pieces so much. I got this from Target. It's just a really cute base, but it has the cutest little shape to it, so I love it. And this is just some pompous grass that I got from Amazon. And I cut the stems a little bit just to make it fit well. And this is also just a little jar that I got from Target. Really cute. Just to fit the vibe. So I love that on my window seal. And over here, I'm obsessed with candles, as you guys probably can see. And this is a candle, again, I got from um, 
TJ Maxx or Home Goods. And then here I have a really cute um, bowl. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm gonna take it down so you can see it. it's really cute. And it's really heavy. It's like a ceramic bowl that I picked up from Target. Really, really cute. And I don't know why, I'm just obsessed with the tops of candles. So I don't like them to not show like this one's doing. So I'm just gonna leave that there. So here's where we get to my color bar, which is another one of my favorite areas. Um, I have a lot of storage over here and I just kind of make use of the space. Here you see is my, just my, um, my steamer. So I don't really have anywhere to store that. So I just usually leave it right there. So here's my rolling cart that I use a lot when I'm doing colors. It just makes things really easy. I really suggest having one of these if you are a stylist. Now here is my sink, as I said, and I just keep this here. This is what I use when I have like drinks and stuff for my clients. Um, a room refresh freshener and hand soap. And then here are my shampoos and all of my washing products. And then up here are my colors, my Shazy Q. Love so much colors. And this, these are just open colors that I have. Developer scales, all of that kind of stuff. Sorry y'all, it's not very organized. <laughs> and then down here, same thing, it's a mess, so don't judge. Um, I have a lot of my color tools and water. <laughs> so when we come over here, this is my big cabinet. This is where most of my stuff is. I'm gonna warn you, it's a mess. Okay, I have a lot of stuff that I'm trying to fit in this area. So here is my, um, open cabinet so I hang all of my aprons and my capes here I have a good bit and then here are um, towels microfiber towels which I like to use um, after washing um, more capes here are my rollers flexi rods just some miscellaneous products and that's my section where I keep my food and stuff <laughs> and then I have like hair from Marley Swiss down there Okay, so here's my station. As you guys can see, I love this station. It is huge. I love the large mirror so my clients can fully see themselves. You can see the whole salon through the mirror, so I love that. Um, here is where I keep all of my tools, my styling tools, so my combs, brushes, um, scissors. Everything lives right here. So as you guys can see here, I have three shelves which were initially used for retail. But I decided to spice it up a little bit and just go ahead and use this for some... Um, just some decor pieces. So I went ahead and got this vase here or this jar from Hobby Lobby, I believe. And I got this really, really cute candle. Y'all know I love candles. And it says lemon on it. It's like a cement color. I got that from Target. And then this um, candle, I love this candle. I think it's so pretty. I love a pretty candle. And this is from Marshalls for $8, $7, I'm sorry. And up here is just a little basket with the top I thought was so cute, also from Target. I think that was like $7, so really cute. So here are all of my hot tools. This is where I store them all, I have a lot. Um, this is not even all of them, but this is where I store all of my hot tools, my blow dryer, my flat irons, curling irons, I have more blow dryers and more flat irons down there. Um, yeah, but I love this, I love how handy it is. I can just pull everything, everything fits really well, so I love it, and all of the uh, outlets are right down there. So if you come right in front of my station is a drawer or a cabinet where I keep all of my products. So these are my styling products. Um, yeah, so pretty self-explanatory. And usually that's where I keep all of my things like throughout the day. That little cubby. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, it's a mess, but look, I have to make use of, of the space. This is where I keep all more of my styling tools, miscellaneous items, um, rubber bands, brushes, clips, um, everything. Packaging for my hair. Um, I like to put it back in the plastic bags. And here, I had never seen anybody do this because I, I watched a lot of um, salon tours and a lot of um, salon studio tours. So I really wanted to figure out how to maximize my space the most. And I decided to put my um, dirty towels in the drawer. And that just helped me not have so much stuff on the floor because that's how I had it before. I have my towels on the floor, but I have my dirty towels. I have cleaning products and um, trash bags. Right there. So you guys, I'm back at my favorite spot right under the mirror and under the neon sign. It just makes me really happy to see this space transform into what it has become now. Um, when I first moved in here, I was 
clueless, okay? I had a whole other vibe I was going for. But after time, this has taken me probably about a year to really get this together. Um, and I really love it. I hope you guys love it as well. I want to do more videos like this where I take you into the salon and just kind of switch it up sometimes. So let me know what kind of videos you would like to see. I will hopefully be back soon. And I'll see you guys next time. Oh, <laughs>